I'm great. So you've been out here working, doing your thing. Yes. Listen, yes, so have. you recently got your doctorate degree. Yes. That is crazy. That y'all, yes. Listen, with all this work that you're doing, yeah. how how did you even find time to get your degree? Well, um, when you're doing something that you really feel passionate mm -hmm. about, the time flies by and you really don't even realize so much time has gone by and you've been... What? Oh, just... oh take the mic. Yeah. Oh, oh! Oh, was I supposed to do that at first? Sorry. <laughs> you good. I'm just excited to be here. <laughs> yeah, we yeah. excited to have you on. Yeah, so um, how did I get my doctorate degree yes. in humanitarianism? Yes. Well, when the time goes by and you're just doing something that you're really passionate about, you don't even realize you've been serving the community and, and giving back and just finding a way to find your purpose and stay connected to it and all the craziness of life. Right. You know, yeah. like giving back community service, volunteering with all the organizations I'm a part of. It's yes. really been a lifesaver for me and really has kept my sanity in check and kept me grounded about what's really important in life. Right. And I like how on social media, how you're now portraying that more and more with more speaking, the use, more engaging, letting people know like, you know, you may be down, but you can do this. Or if you do a, an audition, you know, no, this, the no mean next opportunity. Don't give up. Like, that's, that's great. Oh, yes. Yes. I feel like I have to pass it on because I know how it is as an artist. You have a dream. Mm -hmm. You you're out here fighting for your dream yes. year after year after year. You want to see results and you need motivation. Mm -hmm. And it's really great when someone that has gone where you want to go right. reaches back and says, hey, listen, if you want to go down this road, uh -huh. you want to be an actress, let me tell you some things I learned along the way that really helped me. And I hope that they can save you some time. Right. Yeah, I like that. I like that. And I always want to know, like, Jasmine, you've dealt with so much. You've done so much. I remember we first met Saints and Sinners yeah. at um, Sweet Food Lounge when they did the press day. Yes. Yes. That's a long time ago. So, yeah, that's been admitted. Season two. Yes, it was season two. And that's when we, we met. And from there, you just always like, Genario, keep going. Genario, even when we was at the ball, like, Genario, keep going. And now that you're doing it with the youth, with your motivation to speak in your book. So let's talk about the book. How did the book come about? Yes, work your audition. Work, work your, your audition. audition. 